Morning, folks. Thanks for tuning in to another video today. Don't know how you know how well this video is going to come out or whatnot, but uh, don't really have a whole lot on the agenda today. Just down here at the river, as you can tell behind me. I'm down here. I'm gonna maybe do a little fishing and whatnot, and uh, we might do a couple of little gear reviews while we're down here. Um, uh, it's real windy today. It feels really nice. I've been working out here, so I'm kind of sweating. Working as in getting some firewood. I'm going to do a little, make me a little fire over here, and. Um, cook up some canteen cup coffee and uh, yeah just do a little fishing out here at the river. The river's up still we had some rain um, a little less than a week ago uh, probably about three or four days ago we had some rain so the river's kind of up but nevertheless we're gonna try our luck and see what we can do I heard something jumping uh, a few minutes ago so you know we'll see so anyway stay with me folks my name is Chris watch the Ghost Survive I'll be right back For starting my fire today, I'm just going to use some of this fire gel I picked up from um, the Canteen Cup Roastery as well. And my new Firefly uh, ferro rod for my Swiss Army knife. So yeah, that's what we're going to do here. This thing works really good. Really, really well. I'll do a review on it coming up. So let's get this fire going here. This fire gel is, um, you just squirt it out and light it. I don't know if it's going to light with a ferro rod. I've never tried it, so we'll, we will try it and see. Probably will though. So, yeah. Alright, get this out here. Let me zoom in for you. And I just use I just use the knife portion, I mean the saw. You turn this to the side here. I kind of show you around the spot here a little bit. So out today I'm just using my Kafuru Scout Pack. Got it out today, kind of going kind of light. I say that all the time, but I always end up overloading it. But anyway, the river comes down this way, goes down this way, and I'm like on a little sandbar here. So that's why I don't really have a problem starting a fire right here because it's still so wet right here. And then when the river floods, it's just going to wash all this away anyway. So nobody will even know I've been here. But I found this tree here that fallen across the river. I found it on my last camp out and uh, myself and a buddy of mine finally I've always said in several older videos that I've never been able to cross the river but uh, we come down here and we were just scouting around and I found this tree so we crossed it and we were able to cross the river finally and go up there up there's that cow pasture that I keep telling you that you know if you hear cows in my background you know so the cow pasture's up there and uh, we found way down there where the coyotes are running, they're coming in through the cow pasture, and they're either running the cow pasture, that ridge line, or they're coming down here and running right across, right across here on the other side of the river and running down and getting back out to the road. So, yeah, cool little spot here. So, water's about to come to a boil, hopefully. It's very windy, like I said before, so when water gets to a boil, I'm going to make up some coffee, and I'll be right back with you. my hidden woodsman pouch here. Get my coffee in there. Coffee bag. Some snacks.
probably been fishing now for, I don't know, an hour maybe. Hadn't caught anything, so. But you kind of had a feeling that was what's going to happen because, like I said, the river's kind of up still and it's real cloudy uh, from it being up. But anyway, it's about 11, 11 15 or so, so it's time for some lunch. So I brought down today some, some beef summer sausage and some cheese and crackers. So that's what I'm going to eat for lunch. And uh, so I stay with me, I'll, I'll be right back. That's amazing. When the spring changes or the time changes from winter to spring and whatnot, it's amazing the uh, growth comes springtime out here. Earlier in the winter, you could see all the way through here, but now it's getting grown up. I almost got lost in here, and I've been down here, I can't tell you how many, you know, hundreds of times I've been down here, but um, you almost get lost in all this stuff if you don't know what you're doing and where you're going. So get out and check your surroundings different times of the year. Well folks, no fish today, but um, that's fishing, right? <laughs> Such is life. So I uh, got all packed up here. I got to go back to the house. Got some other obligations to do today um, at the house. So um, anyway, I just want to thank you for watching. Short little video on uh, just getting out here and uh, doing a little fishing little campfire, a little coffee and whatnot uh, by the river today. So thanks for watching. I'll see you on another video real soon. Please like, share, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more. Thanks.